Welcome back to Never Tales, The Beauty Within. We this is my humble cottage. We are at this humble cottage. It's not much, but it's home, and that's what matters. Come inside. I might have something that can help you in your journey. So yeah, we just have a random friend, Maria, and she's helping us make stuff. Welcome! I was thinking how to repay you for showing me the way back home. So I thought of a great potion which is bound to help you in your adventures. It's a wish potion of sorts, and it will help you fulfill something you need or want. In order for it to work, we need to make it together. Ready? Okay, let's do it. First I need a peacock feather to add some grace to the potion. <laughs> this is so crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we, we were we were finding a baby who was kidnapped and trying to return it and we got trapped inside a, a monster mansion and now we're just on a volcano island. Making potions. Next, a mandrake root. This will give it some pizzazz. I don't know what a mandrake root looks like. Oh, I'm gonna have to use a hint. I need some ginkgo leaves. They will make the potion full of life. So ginkgo leaves are white and they look like a fan. Excellent. Now find me some paradise flowers to bring an exotic power to the potion. Paradise flowers are, are like these things, these things. Fantastic. Find me some chili peppers to make it spicy and zesty. Great work! They will need to be crushed into a fine powder first. I need some snake venom next. Be careful collecting it. Pretty simple puzzle, just, just find all the things she's talking about. And for the last ingredient, I need a unicorn horn. There's one behind the old cage, but you'll have to move it aside to get it. Alright, so with this I need uh, a weight. I don't know why I can't just walk around the cage, but no matter. That's it! We're ready! Now stand back a bit as I prepare the potion. By the wind, earth, thunder, and fire, grant the wish of a user's desire. Whoa. There, it's done. May it help you in some way during your journey. So this gives me whatever I wish. I wish I knew what was going on. No, 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 that's, 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 that's wishing for too much. So in order to get this working, I need to find ink, right? Okay, so I need to find ink first. I don't know where I can find ink. Okay, it says the ink is here on the island shore. So does anybody see anything which resembles ink? I see a rose. Oh, here we go. Looks, looks like gears can fly and find us some ink. Okay, put the ink inside the potion. Next, I'm going to use the potion on the paper. So what is my wish? I wish for a million dollars. Oh no, I, I'm wishing for a map. Oh, well, well, I should probably wish about the evil person who, who, who is trying to kidnap the baby, you know? How do I save the baby from the evil bad guy? That would be a good wish. So this is a puzzle. With this puzzle, you want to click on the thing which is different. So the different head is this one. It's looking to the right. The animal that's different is the shark, because all the other animals are mammals. This is a different rock, because it has a hole in it. This, this leaf is different. It doesn't have as many lines as the others. This tree doesn't have leaves. And this is different because signs, both signs are pointing left. 
high up in the sky it spews flames. Okay, so this is a puzzle. We just need to click on an item according to the clue. Slowly crawling on the ground, it's a snail. Arms crossed, it's this thing. The kingly bird is an eagle. Kissed by a princess, it's a frog. Treads the ground, it's a foot. Lend me yours, I'll lend you mine, let's shake hands. Watch these moves. Okay, so signs on the ground, bear paw. What likes eating rabbits and chickens? A fox. Keep yours on your shoulder, keep your head on the shoulder. Keep, keep your head on your shoulders in order to find the treasure. Or at least, a chain. Hmm. Well, this is an unexpected chain of events. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to go back here? Okay, hint says there's something back here that I missed. A bunny rabbit? Okay. I found a bunny rabbit. Oh, and I found another pearl. Well, that's beautiful. And this is a thing. Strange necklace. Could it belong to Maria? I don't know, Maria. Is this yours? My necklace of sight. Wherever did you find it? Ah, uh, so my potion guided you to it. Hey, wait. I thought the potion was supposed to give me what I needed, not what you needed. Did you, did you make the potion wrong, Maria? Then your heart seeks the truth within. Lend me something dear to your heart. Well, I like How this. How beautiful. This will do nicely. Necklace of sight. Reveal the key to her desire. Okay, do that, but first, could you do it in song? Please? What kept you alive with us quickly? One sad fool hell is now always sickly to restore it home a secret is me in one of the things which you hold most dear searching in books of every kind for a sketch Thank you for the musical number. That was beautiful. Incredible. Your heart holds many secrets, but this locket is the key which will unlock them. You must seek the heart gems. Only through restoring them will you activate the locket's power. I hope this will aid you as well. Simply dilute this powder to create a powerful herbicide. So apparently, apparently, we need to find four hearts to open up our family family locket. And this is the reason why I think that random woman you saw in the stained glass window, the one who looks like me, she's holding, she's wearing the family locket. So is she like one of my ancestors? Could be. So herbicide destroys these plants here, giving me a shovel. And I assume the shovel is going to dig up that fantastic buried treasure. Hmm. Oh, a part of the rose is missing. Well, I have this. And this is a puzzle. The key... Okay, B3 and then C2 and then D4. So, B3... C2, D4, A3. <laughs> Gives me one of those hearts that I need. Uh oh. Okay, volcano went off. I think I'm gonna die now. No, we have to get out of here. Maria! 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 Uh, let's hope she noticed. The portal has collapsed when Volcano went off. 
I will cast a protection spell around my cottage, but it's not safe for you and the baby to stay. Use my boat to get to the ship. Get away as far as possible. Thank you for getting me back home. Now I have to protect it. Go now, the time is running out. Good luck to both of us. Okay, so like like one of those bad guys on Dragon Ball Z, she creates a protection shield. And now I'm just going over here to this pirate ship. I think it's a pirate ship. I don't know. Let's let's see. Okay, gears, help me on board. Oh yeah, it's a pirate ship. Whoa. What the? Okay, I have some paint. It looks like I'm gonna have a cannon puzzle. Yeah, yeah, we've got the cannon already, but we need to we need to fire the cannon some at some point. What the? Hey, hey, Mister. Hello, hello. Who's there? Oh, hi. Who are you? I'm Argelfump. Who are you? My name is Caliban. Calavan Sterling. I'm an astronaut, but misfortune brought me here. Instead of being the first man on the moon, I ended up being the prisoner of a lunatic. Wait, the first man on the moon? People landed on the moon in the 60s. That was like 50 years ago at this point. You're really late to be the first man on the moon. Unless you're a time traveler? He kidnapped me, threw me into this hold, and took up my place on the expedition to the moon. Whoa, you were kidnapped by time-traveling Neil Armstrong? Something is very wrong about him. He's no ordinary man, I'll tell you that. Can you help me get out of here? Wow, this is, this is crazy. I don't have anything that would be of use to you, other than these matches I use to light up the rockets. Wait, you light up the rockets by yourself? Isn't that dangerous? How do you light the match to your rocket ship and then get back inside the rocket ship on time? Sir! Okay, well, uh, I, I, I attached the chain to to uh, this guy's little thingy. That way, when I fire this, this cannon, the cannon will go backwards to the recoil, ripping off the cage. That was quite a show. It's good to see the sky without a view behind bars. Uh-oh. Back off! This child belongs to me. If you follow me, you'll never see her again. Baby looks pretty calm about being kidnapped by a creepy guy. And now the pirate ship I'm on is going to sink into a whirlpool. What happened? I was just a lawyer at home reading a book, and then now I'm on a, I'm on a, I'm on a, I'm on a pirate ship about to die with a random, random time traveling astronaut. <laughs> oh, I've made horrible life choices. Where's that my was life? the monster who kidnapped me. I don't know what he wants with your baby, but it can't be good. Well, it's not my baby. I mean, I just found it on the doorstep. I, I didn't actually give birth to the baby. Wait, I remember this place. There was a portal back to my world in the observatory. Can you help me find it? Ah, so it looks like the time-traveling astronaut has been here before. And what you do is you put pearls over here. Puzzle, puzzle, puzzle. Out of nowhere, the beastly stranger appeared. I'm calling the stranger Mr. Hyde. He, 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 Mr. Hyde is a bad guy. Okay, red and blue. Okay, and you just kind of have to guess with the other three colors. But once you guess uh, what the colors are, that lets you inside here. This is... he took the baby, but there's still a chance. Thank you, Mystery Note Writer! And yeah, that is definitely my family crest, so if I have enough hearts, I can open this door. I only have one heart right now, so I guess I guess I can't open it. I'm just sort of like a heart failure. If I had, like, crayons or something I could color in that painting, well, sure, but why would I want to? I've got better things to do than playing with crayons, right? 
Actually, no, nothing is more important than playing with crayons. I'm wrong, I'm sorry. I'm a lawyer. I love playing with crayons. Put a red book here and the owl goes down. Seems simple enough, and uh, if, I, if I find a red book, I'll, I'll, I'll use it. Okay, okay, so I put the red heart there. Need the red book here. And I bet that, yeah, 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 I bet I'm not doing anything besides for here. What am I doing here? Am I putting my pieces on the board? I still need a third ornate piece, and then I'll be able... Then I'll be able to finish with this area. Hmm. Those flowers make a good bouquet if I could find something to cut them with. I guess that's true. This is crazy. Some weird sort of science door. And, and the final ornate piece. Okay, beautiful. So this is about as far as I played uh, the game the first time I played. I got to here, and, and then I stopped. So I, I stopped at this hidden objects challenge. So from here on out, everything is just going to be new to me, and I will have no idea what to do, and it looks like we're building something. So I need to find a mirror and some grapes. There's a mirror. That's an apple. Oh, I need a sliced apple. Okay. Fish, or I mean, that's that's the boat. Um, okay, there's a hat. Uh, sickle, sickle. Helmet, helmet. I'm coloring a painting. So I need to find an elephant, and I need to find grapes. Elephant! Yay, I found one item on my own. Grapes! A caterpillar and a sliced apple, so... Hmm. There's the apple there, I just need to find something to... Caterpillar. I just need to find something to cut the apple with. This... Aha, here we go. Ceramic pieces, huh? Ah, okay. I got this. This is a jigsaw puzzle. I haven't seen one of those in a while. That gives me this fish? What the... Earthquake? Not an earthquake. Adventure section. We're in the adventure section. Library. These curtains are heavy. The exhibit could probably be opened elsewhere. So this is the adventure section of the library with guns. Very good for blowing stuff up. And I found part of a rocket. Okay, so this is a magnet stand. What? What is that? That, that electron is pretty fast. Do I need a magnet or something? How... How do you collect an, an electron? Electrons are usually too small to be able to be seen. Ooh, and a red book! I found the red book. And I found a punch pin. That resembles a planet. Ooh, another book mystery. Pierre refused to give up on her, even when his doctor said there was no hope. He spent hours researching until he discovered the legend of the Rose of Life. The legend of the Rose of Life. Okay, so Pierre is still trying to figure out how to save his, his um, dying girlfriend. This magical flower had the ability to cure any disease simply by smelling its fragrance. Hmm, wh wow, wow, that's, that's pretty amazing. Way to go, magic flower. The Rose of Life only grew in a faraway kingdom, but it had not been seen for centuries. 
Oh, you think somebody would have found it and, you know, marketed that thing? You, you can make a fortune off of that. Pierre traveled to the farthest kingdom searching for the Rose of Life. What did he do about his baby? I mean, he left his baby behind? As he walked, he carried a magical compass that would lead him to his heart's desire. As long as he focused on the rose, the compass would lead him to it. Hmm, I sense a big butt coming along here. For days, he thought only of finding the rose, certain that he would find it for his love. I don't know. I'm, I'm still searching that. Things must have... I'm still feeling things went wrong. I... That does not sound like a story with a happy ending. And hey, that pharaoh mask we've been carrying around forever. It's... It's for this. Okay. Oh, okay. So Pierre tried to find the rose. I really hope the story has a happy ending. I don't think the story has a happy ending. I think, I think our buddy, poor Pierre, poor Pierre, he got distracted, and his wife died. His wife got turned into a stained glass window. Oh, hey, we're back at this stained glass window. The woman who looks exactly like me, except some, somehow more gorgeous and, and, and better looking and successful. And gosh, why does dad like my older sister better? I told dad I, I you know I, just, just just because Rebecca you know you know is really good at school doesn't mean I have to be I'm better at music but dad doesn't want me to be a musician he made me become a lawyer instead uh, life life is rough when you're a fictional video game character a fictional video game character with a much more attractive older sister. Awful, and I bet that magnet. Oh, adventure section, right? Okay, so I bet this magnet catches the electron. <laughs> Electrons. Okay, so the electron was over here on this door, right? Ooh, opens up the observatory. So we're we're making progress. We we only have like three or four more rooms left. But we still have like three, three, three or so hearts to find, so I imagine we're not making like a huge amount of progress. Yeah, we, we, we can't be like three steps away from the end of the game. We still got lots more games to play. And what is this? This, that, that is a broken thing. Ooh, and this is one of those books. All right, we haven't seen one of these puzzles in a while. We are finding pictures of a planet. And an easy way to solve this puzzle is to say just shut and open it. The piece you're looking for is going to disappear and reappear. So let's see what it is. Okay, so that, that piece there. So you'll notice it only appears when I open the book. So that's how you can help locate which piece is which. And that gives me the Saturn medallion. Ooh, a lunchbox. I want some lunch, I'm hungry. And I'm making a rocket. Great. Is there anything else on the screen? This is a puzzle. Touch the correct constellation on B, which is displayed on... Where's A? Can I see A? Okay, A is here. So I find A, and I touch the correct constellations on B. B. If I make a mistake, okay, move things around. Okay, I got it. Okay, so I move things around on C until I find these constellations. So I'm looking for an L and then a, a, a mountain. And what? <laughs> I like how my owl thing looks like he thinks I'm going to die. I think this is it. Oh, that's not it. Oh, come on. Do I want to skip it? Sure. I... 
I'm a horrible excuse for a puzzle solver, and I apologize. Hmm. Don't I have a continent here? I do. Whoa. Okay, North America just set something on fire. Why did North America do that? North America, that was not a very nice thing for you to do. Okay, Saturn. Ha! I can solve that puzzle. Just click like three times in a row. I can always solve a puzzle like that. Unless it's one of those puzzles where you have to click like a thousand things in a row. Okay, so zero plus zero equals seven. Okay, so one plus six equals seven. Something minus one equals eight. So nine minus one equals eight. Something divided by something. Okay, so six divided by two equals three. And nine times two equals eighteen. Cool, what did that give me? That gave me a decoder device? Did I get something for solving that puzzle? I, I feel like I should have gotten something for solving that puzzle. Ah, no matter. I've also got this puzzle I can solve now, and maybe this will be an easy puzzle. So it looks like this is an Egyptian puzzle. Yep. Ah, and that opens up this, which is a... a activate the cannon. I already activated a cannon in this in this in this video, huh? Guess this game really likes cannons. Okay, I need to soak it with fuel. I've got fuel. I should light it up now. I with what? I have matches here. I like how this cannon has far less recoil than the previous cannon. Okay, so I'm finding a bunch of hidden objects. Oh my gosh. I, I, I can't handle this too much. Okay, so I need to find shoes and masks. And... Okay, so when I find something, it goes on to the painting. Okay. This might be slightly easier. Now that the board has been mostly cleared, I can calm down. I found... What was... I... I don't know what that is. Okay, I need to find a bird, a horse, and a glove. A boxing glove. Ah, oh, that's clever. There's a horse. And a bird is here. Okay, saved. I thought that puzzle would be far too difficult for me, but it wasn't, it wasn't. I, I, I managed to save the day, and this is a palette. Looks like it needs colors. I've only got one paint can, so I'll need to find a second. I'm gonna use a hint here. Huh. I want to use a hint just in case I miss something with that decoder puzzle, but apparently I did not. Apparently I'm finished. And when I get all my paint, I imagine I'll be painting that thing. Okay, so I've got stuff in the inner garden and the observatory. These flowers would make a good bouquet. Okay. Sure, fine. Let's make make a bouquet. Why am I making a bouquet? Am I going to get married today? Is that the storyline? That would be a plot twist. Hopefully I'm not going to marry that creepy, angry man. Yeah, that, that, that is something I really hope is not the case. Baby, kid uh, baby kidnapping person. I don't like him. And I got a bouquet. <laughs> I don't know why I have a bouquet, but now something's here in the adventure section, which means I'm probably using the bouquet somewhere here in the adventure section. Like here? That's cute. And that gives me a flower? I mean, that gives me some paints? Can I paint here? Because usually I need a brush to paint something. Wow, what is this game's obsession with blowing things up with a cannon? Yeah. Yeah, seriously, game, you need to calm down. Not everything needs to go boom and explodey and stuff. Green here, and I'm 
imagine that's green as well. This is yellow, and everything else is brown. Brown. Hmm. What do I have wrong? Oh. Some of these stars are brown. Craziness! Anyway, I solved the puzzle, giving me a clue for another puzzle, and some sort of electromagnet.